Hey guys, in this video, I will be going through all of the different reasons why connecting to your friend's LAN world in Minecraft isn't working. My previous videos on how to play in your friend's world got many comments asking for help, so hopefully this video can do that. The first thing you should do is to check and make sure that both you and whoever you're playing with are both connected to the same network. After all, LAN stands for Local Area Network, so this can only be done locally on the same connection. And you must not be using a VPN. If you want to play with your friend who lives further away, you have to host a server, which is a more complicated process but can be also done for free. Secondly, you also have to make sure that both you and whoever you're playing with are connected to the network with the same method. So I'm connected via ethernet, my brother is also connected on ethernet, and that's how we're able to play together. Now if you are connected on Wi-Fi, then your friend also has to be connected on Wi-Fi. The third thing to check is that both you and whoever you're playing with must be in the same exact Minecraft version. As of recording, the latest release is 1.19.3, so whoever I'm playing with also has to be on that exact same version. And you can go back in versions, like I could still do 1.16.3, but whoever I'm playing with also has to be in 1.16.3. The next thing to check is that you have actually open your Minecraft game to LAN, like so. And if this seems completely new to you, make sure you check out my other videos explaining how to do this in depth, linked above and in the description. Now for some actual fixes. The first thing is to check your network and make sure that it's set to private. So you can do this by going here and searching network status. And if you click on properties, you can see there's two options, public and private. And you want to make sure that private is checked so that your computer can look for and trust other computers on the network. Now, if you've done this and it's still not working, you can also disable your firewall. You can click on this link here to be taken to the firewall page. Now, the only thing you'll need to disable is your private firewall. You can do that by clicking this and clicking off, but make sure that you turn it back on after playing with your friend. So this is not a permanent solution. If you want a permanent solution, you can go here where it says allow an app through the firewall. Once you get to this page, scroll down until you find these Java SE binaries. You can go up here and click change settings, and you're going to want to make sure that all of them are allowed through the private firewall, like this. Also, to make sure of this, you can click here where it says allow another app, and you can find the Minecraft launcher, which for me is on my desktop right here. Click open and add, and then you can click OK. And now Minecraft has permanently been added to your firewall, so you don't have to keep turning this off and on every single time. A last resort is to go to the control panel and go to network and internet and then network and sharing center and click here where it says change advanced sharing settings and you should see your private settings and make sure that you have the same things checked as I do. If you have followed all the steps that I have done, you should see your friend's local Minecraft game show up here. And if it still doesn't, then you can go down here to direct connection and in here, you'll put in your friend's private IP address. So to find this, you can figure out how to find their IPv4 address, which will look something like this. And this address is completely private, so it doesn't matter if other people know it, as they can't access it anyway. After that, you're going to want to put a colon and the LAN number that you got when whoever was hosting the Minecraft world opened their game to LAN. It showed a five-digit number in chat. After this colon, you're going to want to put that five-digit number. And once you have all this information entered, you can click Join Server. And as you can see, I'm now joined into my friend's game. So hopefully these steps worked for you guys, and hopefully you're now able to play with your friends in Minecraft. Thank you for watching. It would help me out if you could subscribe and like the video. And if it didn't work, leave a comment and I'll try to get back to you.